you take that vector out, deep vector spinal muscle, and resolve it into its component vectors, it squeezes the vertebrae together, and it, and it, it, it doesn't create posterior shear as much as it checks anterior shear. In other words, we have an obligatory, you know, because we're upright and gravity is always, um, you know, uh, uh, pulling on the spine because of the lordotic uh, spine, there's always this shear force that is on the spine. So we've got a lot of connected tissue restraints like ligamentous tissue and, and the way the joints are oriented to help check anterior shear. But when, when those break down, we rely on neuromuscular strategies to check anterior shear whether that's you know, trying to roll the pelvis back to minimize anterior shear, whether it's increased contraction. And I, I, I totally agree with what, what um, uh, Pete mentioned this morning. When you're looking at the state of contraction of muscles, you know, sometimes you have to ask yourself, is that hurting the person or is that helping the person? Because a lot of this is reflex muscle guarding to help check some mechanics that can't be, you know, that, that, are, that are, are no susceptive uh, for the patient. So, you know, before we, you know, we, we find these tender points or whatever on the PSIS and the iliac crest and stretch them and rub them out and put our elbows in, I think the first, qu to me, the first question is, what were their response with compression and shear? If I put shear stresses, pathomechanical examination, I put shear stresses on the spine and this is, is lit up, I think that's okay. I think it's helping to check that anterior shear. They need that to minimize that uh, anterior shear. So it's not a big extensor of the stuff spine, the, the, um, the deep erector spine. And the deep erector spine attaches to the transverse process, and that's pretty close to where the axis of rotation is. So it doesn't have a good lever arm for extension. So that's why it's, it, when, when you look at it, it's more that compression and shear, more that stabilization of the, uh, of the uh, spine.